Huh? Huh? Where am I? So again, this is a Nightingale. It's like a steampunk survival game. I believe you travel between worlds. I imagine. I think from the trailers that I've watched. But I'm, uh, this is my first foray into it. I'm just curious to see what it is. It's also, it's like 27 bucks. How now, fleshling? With a wonder you lost in our Feywild. It reminds me of Enshrouded a little bit. Kind of like a first person Enshrouded. What's up, Bad Bellman? You danger days. You can go third person. They, they said it was experimental. Those bound and so I decided to not do despair. any experimental thing. Shadows abound. Yet, like a fire's final embers, you refuse to be snuffed out. I come with an offer to guide you to a safer realm, and rebuke death, and like so many of your kin, take these bloodstained cards, what? play them, and let amiable bond be drawn between Fay and Fleshling. Bloodstained cards? Give me your hands, that we may be friends. And I shall restore amends. Amosit in kunul ame. Hurry yonder toward portal and apparatus, so you, bear child Wait, of Earth, you see, what does that might mean? abscond this nightmare. What's wrong with the word puck? Travel to the forest byway swiftly. Across the divide, a greater gift awaits. Partnerships with we fay. Afford many wonders yet unseen. Bye, Puck. Oh, he danced away. I know there's a Puck in Shakespeare. My own cards. Play this card to seek a realm lush with forest. The first discovered realm was a lush forest misleading Red Cross Knights into believing the Feywilds were an analogous to Earth's habitats. How wrong they were. Interesting. And then play this card to seek a small transient realm. Diminutive wilds exist that serve as pathways between larger realms, like a secret passage between two glades. From the Fey, Red Cross Knights learned they were called byways. <laughs> Micah. Nice easty. Uh, um. Huh. Alright, so that should open, open the portal with those. Fly, Rambo. Those cards. The fiends have caught your despairing stench. And I think this is kind of what you do. You like go to different realms and maybe set up a base in a realm that, that feels good to you. Nice, bad idea. Hey, good old Greg. Thanks, good old Greg. For almost three years. Play this card to seek a small... So I, Yeah, so I don't know what a byway means... Like, I don't know what a transient realm is, or a realm lush with forest. This is, I assume, the realm lush with forest, and then we return to Puck, so... Oh! Huh? Who's there? Count thyself among the fortunate few who managed to flee the Pale's noxious proliferation. Nightingale still stands, but Earth teeters on the brink, and these wilds are far from hospitable. Sequestered so and struck by woe begs the question, Wilt thou be a survivor? The gift I promised should aid Wait, Can you just course. tell me what you want, Puck? A hermetic guidebook and pocket watch. Purloined off the corpse of a realm walker. Keep these yeah, he's just like pucking with me. Companions. You're right, St. Steve. With the man-made network sundered, Entrust me to find the trail forward through these byway realms in the interim. I hear your stomach snarling. That's true. Take reprieve from misery and gorge yourself with a feast fit for a fleshling. Chipotle? 
Preserve yourself, and I shall return anon. Oh, under this mask, you wonder. I am Puck. Is Puck Robin me? Am I Puck? Oberon's merry wanderer of the night. The last. Hold on just a second. Hello? I can't. I'm streaming. Yeah, what's up? Oh. Oh, I got worried. Okay. Okay, love you. My wife called me. Wanted to make, it wasn't Rahul. It was my wife. I want to make sure everything was okay. Because it's raining real hard. It's raining real hard. I want to make sure she was uh, she was good. <laughs> it wasn't Puck. Uh, Grumpy Muskets, thank you for the prime. Grumpy Muskets and Ryan for gifting to Morty the Corgi as well. Yeah, when the wife calls, you answer. Especially when it's raining. I'm starving. I know I have V-Sync on. And I, I swear that I see screen tearing, but I could be wrong. I, I swear that I see it. Hopefully you guys, do you guys see screen tearing? Press F to use your equipped offhand item. Mmm, there we go. I'm not starving anymore. Uh, maybe it's just, I don't see VSync anywhere in there. Interface, maybe? Hmm, okay, well. If it gets really annoying, I'll change it. What's this? What did Puck did Puck shit something here? Telegram Oh, it's lore. Okay. Telegrams tell tales of more cities perishing one by one. After Paris, it was Brussels, then Milan, a horrid fog called the Pale Billows, forth from the portal in Paris. We've known of the pale. Something has shifted. Okay. So it sounds like I think you can collect everything in here too. It sounds like we're like losing cities one by one. I'm gonna go ahead and eat some blueberries. The water does look really good. You're right. I agree. It's all this is all Unreal 5, so looks really nice. Acquire rocks, acquire sticks, acquire raw berries. Those are sticks. Can I collect these rocks? I can, all right. And then... Hey, Kid Masters. Thank you for the prime, Kid Masters. Very, very much for being here almost four years. All right, press B to open the guidebook. Oh, well, the campfire. I'll put it right here. Interact with the cooking pot of the campfire to begin cooking. Select your recipe and ingredients and press cap craft to cook. Okay. Ooh, roasted berries. And then I think I need fuel. All right, eat roasted berries. Return to Puck. 
Where's Puck? Oh my gosh, there he is. <laughs> You've avoided embarrassment by staving off starvation. From the lingering scent, your meal was no summer court banquet. But at least you persist. We must carry forth whilst this byway is aligned with another. One which should get us closer to necessities we'll both require. The portal stands nearby. Delay not, for the withering sands await. Okay, locate this realm's portal and venture into the desert byway realm. Is it is it on the compass? Do I do go? Do I, I wonder if I go back to the same spot I was in. Because <clears throat> it just says locate this realm's portal. But does that mean that I? Is that part of the objective? Is to find it? I don't know how big these. Uh, and there's a lot of deer. <laughs> there's deer everywhere. Um, I don't know if that like how big these worlds are. Is there a map? Oh, there is. Oh my gosh. Oh holy hell. Oh there it is. Okay great. Uh. Get out of my way, dear. Yeah, this does. Uh, somebody said this reminds you of the forest, and I completely agree with you. Oh, okay, it's just this. All right. <laughs> the deer are building a civilization. I mean, they own this island clearly. Look at they're just running into me. Uh. Desert card. Play this card to seek a realm of arid desert. And then this is the byway card. Still don't really know the... The desert card makes sense to me, right? I'm going to go into a desert, but I don't know what the byway card means. It is kind of cool. I agree. Ah, Greg Bain. Good, good advice. I also I don't know how big the uh, servers get in terms of like how many people you can have on a server. I don't know if it's four or eight or whatever or as many as you want. You know, I don't, who knows? I'm hot. Can I stand in the the shade? Okay, great. I just started. I'm 12 minutes in. Return to Puck. Puck. So he's gonna he's gonna be like, make sure you find some water. Is this Puck? That's the portal. Puck? Parties of six. Okay. Hey, Puck? Puck, do you see the, uh... Do you see the, the tree walking? Ah! Jeez. Puck, I'm... I'm in the shit. Summer runs through my being as blood runs through yours. Yet I've seen that dew men call sweat flow like rivers in our deserts. This heat Headless music, it's always a pleasure to have you. Thank you, music, alike. for being here almost four years. How be it? Enduring the elements is part of the realm walker's folly. Pleasure sought through vanquishing hostility. Whether this pleases or not, Without shelter and the means to defend it, you'll not last long. Best to test your nesting prowess and avoid exhaustion while I scour for the next byway. All right, build a stick tent. Uh, there's a stick tent. <laughs> uh, well, I, should, I probably shouldn't put it in the sun, right? Now let's put it right here. Is this kind of in the sun? It sort of is. Alright, I need more plant fiber. I'm like, really? I'm afraid of that thing. I don't know what it's going to do to me. No. Okay.
Boy, it's really, really hot. Okay. No more plant fibers? What? Uh, where is it? Is it inventory? Hey Fla Bruce, well, I'm on medical leave again this time for my seizures, oh. so I just want to give you a little tip a -roo. Thanks, Bruce. Oh, you give me a tip a -roo. <laughs> Thanks, bad idea. <laughs> As always, bad idea. Please take it easy. I love that you said tip a -roo. There's text-to-speech? There's always been text-to-speech. For as long as I've been streaming. For seven years. What do you think about that? What are these little things? What are these scary little things? I need more plants. I don't know how to get plant fibers. Those are just only sticks. Am I getting plant fibers out of that? Huh. <gasps> it's my puff. Thank you very much, puff. Yeah, I know. I'm just trying to figure out what gives me plant fibers. I know that it shows me in the bottom right, but... It could be anything, you know what I'm saying? Uh, it could be this bush, it could be this tree. I truly don't know. Thanks, Puff! Uh, let's see here. It seems to be kind of a random... A random generation. Treetop, I've only been streaming it for 17 minutes. Uh, so I definitely don't have a verdict yet. Still no plant fibers, huh? Fiber. It's the most basic form of fiber grants. One of the means extracts into one essence dust, but it doesn't tell me how I picked it up. <laughs> so I have no idea. Also, I'm gonna like I'm gonna die of hunger. I'm starving. Puck, can you help me out, dude? This is always where these survival games, like, for me, they become, they can be really, really difficult. Or not. Like, there's usually some sort of hump you have to get over. Sometimes it's later game, sometimes it's early game. Um, and usually they start out kind of like this, where you're, like, just thrown into a world and then having to do things that you don't know how to do. I have the plants that have flowers. Boy, if only... I'm grabbing everything. It's not even that I'm having to grab a specific plant. I'm just having to find them. That's the hard part. So I'm grabbing anything I can see.
Maybe I'm supposed to die. Yeah, maybe, maybe that's what's going on. I saw that creepy thing, but I'm uh, going to ignore it. No plant fibers from these. There's got to be some plant fibers in here. Here we go. Now we're talking. It's plant fiber rich in here. Right? Are you kidding me? There we go. I was like, what the fuck? Give me all this plant fiber. I need it all. There we go. Um, can I drink this water, do you think? No. What happens if I'm too wet? Is that bad? What the hell is going on? Why did making me wet hurt me? Am I dying? Of, I'm dying of thirst or hunger. But I have yet to find anything that was... Uh, something that was going to feed me. I'm going to probably die here. Oh, hey, uh, make it. There we go. Okay. There we go. Boy, do I feel better. Okay. Craft makeshift wood axe. Boy, I need food, though. <laughs> I need food, like, real bad. Uh... Hold on, hold on just a sec. Hold on a sec. I do mining so I did the wood axe I still need a thousand more plant fibers terrific <laughs> you said you see that's when I just go to Chipotle I, and then I take an hour break uh, and I created I hear a there's no way I can take that on so I'm gonna leave makeshift mining pick do all of these need plant fibers they do all right But at least I have some stamina now, so that's good. So back to the water we go. It's the year of survivals. I mean, like, this year is going to be a weird year for gaming. There's a lot of really good games that have already come out, but it sounds like the Switch 2 is not coming out, and then next year it's going to be GTA and all sorts of crazy stuff. It's going to be a weird year. People are saying the Switch 2 got delayed to... Uh, to next year. We'll see. We'll see if that's actually true or not. That's rumor. That's a rumor. Um... All right, let's make the torch. Make the sickle. Make the mining pick. These resources can be used to craft. By using tools, you can harvest better resources. Each tool. All right. 
right, I need food. Why not build a hut near the o oasis? Esoteric, you, you, you know that I discovered discovered this app after a, a, after after I built the hut. It slipped my skull that Earth's great citadels resulted from decades of toil. Still, I expected more than that lowly truss of sticks and the haphazard cudgel you now hold. Screw you! You'll need better woodworking skills than that when we reach our destination proper. It affords the perfect setting for... Well, we shan't ruin the surprise. Let us depart and speak of your ill-favored constructs no more. <laughs> One final by what way a smug of mock mire. Then this path of beginning shall fork unbounded into whatever endings you seek. Puck, I need some food. Stop dancing away. Will you just give me some food, please? Yeah, Puck sucks. This is swamp card, so we're headed to a swamp. <laughs> Build a hockey thing. There's some lore. Come on, dude. Someone give me some food. Yeah, I would have... Uh, I've said this before, but I would have fired up Helldivers today. I mean, I'm glad that... Honestly, I've been watching this game for months. So I'm curious to see what this is. But I would have fired up Helldivers today. But Helldivers not only had a queue for an hour that I tried to get through, but also... Um, uh, people will be uh, disconnected from Hell Divers on Steam in approximately an hour and a half, and then they're gonna have to fight through another queue. So I'd rather not do that. That doesn't sound like good streaming to me. If not for Astaroth's decree, this trek would have been as easy as peach pie. We Fey are forbidden from consorting with your kind. Oh great, I'm and I while know my I, amity fuck, I is food. yours, it behooves us both to move with caution. But enough prattle. The bound guard Fey I need food, puck. that align with temporal realms. As they're already acquainted with your despair, those fiends will emerge when you try to leave this final byway. While I know man's impulse is to flee. Without pluck, you're sure to expire. Prepare yourself, Realm Walker. Once this fen is within our wake, a fine morsel of knowledge I shall bequeath. Puck's just ahead lie relics of humanity. Wasting my time. Future. I need food, Puck. I don't need poetry. I need berries. Acquire bones. Tier one predator. Uh-oh. Not enough stamina! I finally kill him? Okay, there we go. I can't hear anything because I'm so hungry. Roboscar, thank you for the prime, Roboscar. <laughs> That's why my hearing is all muted. You think what, what do you think is in the in a swamp that I can eat? Rats? I just saw some rats running around. Uh, intense toast. Thank you, intense toast. Always for being here almost two years. I did collect some meat, so I guess I could build a campfire. Uh, building? Is that what it was? Stick tent. Makeshift items. Cooking. Where was... Where was... 
Roasted meat is great, but I need this. There we go. Where is that? This. Right there. I need food or I'm gonna die. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna die real hard. I'm about to, I'm about to pass out forever. <laughs> yeah, this game has multiplayer. It's uh, six players. It's up to six players. And usually, the way these things work is. Where's my meat? Did, did I pick it up? This is not... Gosh, where did it go? Where did it go? Oh, I swear that I made it. Oh, there it is. Seven. There we go. Oh boy, that was close. Okay. Nah, man. <laughs> it's weird that it goes to your hot bar and not your inventory. I wish it would go to both. That's uh that's an important thing that a lot of survival games do. Gypsy Danger, thank you for the prime. Very much, Danger, for being here almost four years. Okay. Oh! Oh my. one angry kangaroo. I don't know what that is. So like, what you're doing is you're basically going to different worlds. They're like kind of like parallel universes, sort of, you know? Um. <laughs> Martyred itself to keep Bruce alive. I guess I don't need water. I only need food, which is kind of an interesting mechanic. Oh, what I was saying before about survival games. Survival games generally have, like, an end game that's really fun. Like, they're, you're supposed to be driving towards something, like building a helicopter, or, you know, like, a rocket launcher, or, you know, like, some some crazy th And I don't know what that is in this game. I, I like, I, I can't look at the tree yet, so I'm not sure. But usually you get super overpowered and shit like that. I gotta kill another one of those, uh... <laughs> Fernando. I gotta kill another one of those predators. The, oh, disease? What the fuck? My disease bar is going up? I also... Did I... Hold on, where's my campfire? Did I lose my campfire? I guess it kind of shows where I was, but... It doesn't... kind of doesn't really show where my... Uh, where I built that. Kangaroos! I guess I'll head toward the... Uh, the portal. And then hopefully happen upon another kangaroo. Yep, 
Yeah, exactly, Papa Bear. To me, this... It reminds me of a, a first person in Shrouded. Come back here, kangaroo. Oh, there's two of them. Ow. A makeshift capelet? I can make a capelet? Oh. There's an entire structure here. What the hell? Hold on, let me make a capelet. Uh, did I equip it, I wonder? No, I haven't tried third person because they said it was experimental and I don't want to break it. Um, did I put it on? Gear? Shoddy coat? Nice, I look great. I look great. Hey everyone. Hey everybody. There's nothing, there's nobody here, right? Probably. All right, there's no one here. I look like a lost NPC. <laughs> You're right. <clears throat> I can't do anything with that. This looks like a... Oh. Go ahead and grab that. I wonder how I'm going to get down now. <laughs> uh... Let's see here. I wonder if I can jump. Uh-oh. Hey, I'm okay! Oh, thank God! The fall damage is forgiving there. Huh? Man, that was... Yeah, that was... I am so glad I did not have to worry about that. Nice! Intense Toast called it an angaroo. Intense Toast, that is very, very clever. I am super, super impressed by that. An angaroo, I love it. Yeah. What, what do we got here? I wonder what that is. Nectar. Okay. <laughs> New Pokemon starter. Can I hit this with a knife or something? Or a sickle? Oh, I can mantle stuff. Yeah, Intense Toast. Very, very clever. I normally hate puns, but that was a very clever, very clever pun. All right, an ingot. Refined from the hides of realm dwelling beasts, this textile is an essential element whether protecting oneself and then more nectar. Okay. Why do I hate puns? Because generally they're not puns. Usually people think they're making a pun and they're not a pun. But an angaroo is very clever. Very, very clever. I'm weighed down by my inventory. Seems like I'm still... Oh, I just can't sprint. Okay. Um, what do I need to drop? Oh, I can consume those. I didn't realize that. I'm going to go ahead and eat all that seed. Uh, 
fabled hide. How do I extract? Is there not a way to split that? My God, I can't stand it. I can't split this? Exit? Control. Right click, shift click. That's right. Yeah, this is the game with portals. Not to be uh, confused with portal. Right, that should give me a little weight to mess with. And then we'll head toward the portal. Get out of here, Angaroo. Oh no, he's killing rats. More Angaroos. Oh wait, acquire, acquire healing salve. Acquire roasted meat. Didn't I already do that? Let's do... Oh my gosh, these angaroos are just going at- there's three of them. Are they killing each other? This one's a big one. Fuck. Okay. Uh, Western, I've only played, played about 40 minutes, so. <laughs> oh, that was the alpha. I did it. I need three of these, right? Why does it matter which one I kill, predator or prey? Killing that alpha is a sigma move. Uh, I also don't know. I don't know how to acquire healing sap, so I have to figure out how to craft that. Get out of here, Angaroo. It looks like like the different worlds are getting taken over by a specific evil where it initially took over our world and now that there are ways to like go to different portals and or go to different worlds and see if those are uh, also being taken over. Healing sad. Oh. I need more fiber. Okay. Ooh, 
the evil of this world is Australian. Exactly. That's right. Uh, there has to be a faster way to do this. Has to be. I know it looks like I'm doing this the slowest possible way, and it feels like it to me too, but... Use essence dust to restore any worn tools or clothing in your inventory. Um, durability. Ah! Ow! Jeez. Gotta eat the meat. I eat this fucking meat. Get out of here. Oh my. Another? Get out of here. What do I need to repair? What do I need to repair here? Okay, return to Puck. You've stolen life to preserve your own. A necessity, lest it become a vice. One imbibed by men like dandelion wine. Now, I've led you about around. Through bog, through bush, <laughs> Holy through, breakfast break, burrito. through briar. <laughs> and forthwith, a temporal realm of abeyance awaits. And so too, Nightingale. First you must oblige your inner essence and choose the landscape that beckons. Aha. No need for words. Only thought. Puck, you're making me wet. And not in a good way. Puck. The progress bar on getting wet is weird. Because, like, where do I stand to not get wet? What happens if I'm too wet? Do I get too cold? Wait, Puck, come back. Puck? Oh, there You've stolen life to now. First, you must oblige your inner essence, the mystery of the home. Play your cards, but beware. The bound will storm once the archway rouses. Crack their pitiable little skulls. Show no mercy. Hmm. Enter into an abeyance realm. Okay, that's the forest card, and this is the abeyance, abeyance card. Play this card to seek a realm of minimal danger, suitable for the construction of an estate. Not even Nightingale's oldest magicians or magicians <laughs> have been able to trace the origins of this card. The Im image printed upon the paper brings intense loneliness to mind. Remain vigilant. While the realms alive. Puck? Can you open it? Puck? Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, my gosh. This item is breaking. Oh, great. Oh, I'm backed up against a tree or something. What's going on? Oh, there we go. Man, 
it. I just always do not have enough stamina. <laughs> I'm still holding my wrap. <laughs> my burrito. I do love that burrito. Where did I kill that other one? I haven't seen a skill tree yet, no. Realm Walker, your path forward is winding and full of terrors. Oh. Save yourself. An hour in. Survive the realms and rebuild all that has been lost. Puck is definitely, definitely evil. I beat the game, that's right. It's over. <clears throat> Am I getting XP for killing things? I didn't see, I didn't see that. Hello, Puck. All right, hold on just a second. Guys, did you talk to Puck? Did you talk to did anybody talk to Puck? What did Puck have to say? Did Puck try to steal my burrito? <laughs> ah, we made it. With the byways left behind, oh, lost New York, you found it. Have ended. Good. I bid you welcome to the Feywilds in earnest. This realm has long been forgotten. Puck tried to sell me Molly. Left in limbo. <laughs> Not unlike you. How fitting. And thus, here is yours to put down roots. But beware. In short Good, time, Chief darkness will descend. And with it, Stygian perils. What the hell is what Stygian? Laying foundations will keep you intrepid, What does Stygian mean, Earth. chat? 
While you play carpenter, there are nooks in these surrounding wilds. I must scrub for the knowledge I pledged. Hey, my puck. Just means dark. This dude is an asshole. I completely agree with you. Uh, repair. Druid stuff? Okay, yeah. I, I hear that word stygian occasionally, and I always wonder what it is. Am I getting plant fibers out of that? Okay, build an estate cairn building. 20 rocks and 5 stone blocks. I'll just go ahead and put it right here. So I have... I don't know how to make stone blocks. Uh, I just mouse over there. I have to click. Huh. Campfire. Well, campfire makes stone blocks? No way. Right? Use your pickaxe on big rocks. Is that a pickaxe? It's always hard to tell. <laughs> Mining pick. Okay, yeah. Oh, okay. There we go. Ah, okay. All right. So it's not actually like crafted stone blocks. It's just like blocks of stones. Thank you, Candace. Oh, it just breaks in one shot, too. Look at that. Does this, when I break this, does this give me rocks too? I think it's just stone blocks. So I have to go around and collect stones instead. Fernando. There we go. There you go, Puck. Your tenacity overrules the gusts of fate. And this fay you have pleased. Settled here, you'll soon wish to venture farther. The unending lure humankind so often succumbs to. Should you hear that siren call, you'll require unbraided cards and the power to play them. Fortunately, both are close at hand. <laughs> and here is the knowledge that Robin's friendship affords. Across this realm lie sites of power sealed by your kin long ago. Forsworn by Fay, even longer still. There are many sites, each granting access to ever more distant spheres. Nearest, though, the Antiquarian. Formidable enough. For one so green, you must first gain entry. Passing through a seal this, forged by those I can't understand a word you're saying. Earth, who claimed but, reverence for our infinite I don't wisdom. understand it. what the fuck you're talking about. They, Stygian and shit. More than most, Just tell me what you need me to do. The gravity of a contract. Oh, thanks, uh, JC. Their gates bar access to those unworthy. But I see that strange, hopeful spark within you. Nurture it with its own fundament. Fundament? Humanity, once within, delve ever deeper. Toward the pedestal. Hurry now, fleshling. Fleshling? Prepare. All right. Unlock the an antiquarian side of power. So you have to get your gear score up. Wow. Okay. How in the world do I get my gear score up? Is it... I have to just make more... I guess maybe... Do weapons have a gear score? They do. Okay. Um, man, Puck is a thesaurus. And then how much am I weighed down? Let me extract this into that. 
Oh, Mervin's good reference, Kenny. Oh, I know, Ken. I know. I know what it is. I just haven't heard that word fundament. <laughs> uh, hold for more options. So I don't know what this does. This respite. I'm still weighed down. What the fuck? Oh. You like a glitch? What's up, Blank Spieler? Building. What can we make? Oh, okay. You can make walls. You need sticks, a wood bundle, and plant fiber to make a crude door, crude foundation. Let's find out how I get a wood bundle, shall we? Can I can I sleep under the stars? Let me see if I can make a a bedroll first. Oh, okay. So simple climbing picks, simple hunting knife. I need straps. So straps needs hide. I need a tanning station for that. Okay. Is this all tanning station? Yes, it is. Simple workbench, tanning station, and campfire. So, let's make a tanning station here. And then I can make some straps there. And then let's make a... A workbench. Oh, I need I need wood bundle. Okay. There are a lot of menus in this game. You're right. Wood bundle. How do I get a wood bundle? Here she comes. Here she comes. Okay. Wood bundle. I'm just always weighed down, like all the time. Crafting is like ESO. I don't. Yeah, I never played ESO, so doesn't matter. Um, Goose is the hype train is all set. I'm gonna give away four video games to get to the end of a level five hype train. I'm gonna give away one copy of any video game at all and three copies. Uh, of a video game of my choice if y'all want me to give away video games and the hype train is all set how many do I have? five terrific lost in New York gifted to Big Bruce Energy who I see here occasionally can I just drop this stuff? what happens when I drop it? It rolls around. Okay. Uh, toast! Oh, toast! Toast gifting 10 people. Aristos. Satanic Gualdo. Hyperfocus Gamer. Alvor Carnicorp. Spider Man Wannabe. 10102. Fervent Piranha. Zyke. And Thades. Toast has gifted almost 200 people. Uh, huge bomb from Toast. Three more people. Three more people to start the hype train gooses. It should be off to a fantastic start. Thanks to Toast. I'm definitely weighed down. 100% weighed down here. King Kiwi gifted to Infinite Soup. Infinite Soup, do something nice for somebody else. Pay it forward. You know what to do, Soup? Let's do... How much do I have? Oh, yes, of course. One more wood bundle. Of course. Of course. Probably need to eat some food. Wait a minute, hold on. Is this rotten? Why is this gray? 
consume. I wonder why it's gray. That's weird. Uh, Hipcads, thanks for the bits, Hipcads, as always. One more person to start the hype train, Gooses. One more person to start it. <laughs> instead of a wood game, or instead of a free game, could I have a wood bundle? <laughs> yes, absolutely. Put that right there. Building traits modify the function of certain structures. Benches gain the grit trait if they're built on the bare ground. You can avoid this by placing benches on a foundation or on existing structures within the realm. Alright, so I need to put them on a foundation and on a... All sorts of things. Radosaurus with the... Uh, four year, Almost four years, Radosaurus. Wow, I don't I don't get to see Radosaurus here very often. Radosaurus gifted to Cam McGiff. On Liu, original Creaky Roadkill, and Tywin. Pay it forward. We got gifted from R Radosaurus. We gotta be level three. Is this level three? Are we in level three already, Gooses? I feel like we're already in level three. Level two, halfway through two. <laughs> Evil Neptune, are you okay, buddy? <laughs> the information is like literally one click away. You'll be all right, Evil Neptune. Chief Chavez, gifting to Mick and Greenleaf and Jacob and Ross Al Ghul and Cash Nation. Thank you, Chief Chavez. <laughs> all right, Evil Neptune, you got it. How about that? How about that? Is this Bruce from Machinima? Oh my gosh, I haven't worked at Machinima for 10 years. <laughs> Thank you, Chief Chavez, for gifting almost 200 people. So we got to build some foundations here. Man, YouTube is wilding out over there. What's my favorite game that I've played so far? Dark Moon Dragon, do you mean this year? Um, crude Foundation, Stone. This is just Stone Blocks. What would be easier? Stone blocks look like they'd be way easier, but maybe the, maybe the stones are hard to find. That's great, Chief Chavez. There was still an hour long queue, so. Um, what's up, Klee? We're almost to level three, Gooses. Go ahead and drop these. Drop these. Drop all this stuff. Build a campfire over here. Not at all, Infinite Soup, no. I stream on YouTube as well. Uh, let's try this. There we go. Yeah, Helldivers has been, I think, my most fun experience so far. Although they're really making it so that people uh, have a hard time playing it. <laughs> <laughs> really, they are trying hard to make it so that uh, people can't play their game. Um, place it here. Not at all, devil of a deal. Um, how do I? Easy. Easy. Oh, that's actually great. That's great. Gooses were almost to level three. Almost to level three. If we get to the end of level five, I give away four video games. Still way down by my inventory, huh? Is this because I picked it up? Did I, when I walk over it, do I just randomly pick it up? What's going on? Why, I for sure dropped this. Did I randomly press E around it? Okay. Craft lab pushing us into level three. Craft Lab gifting five gooses. Hey, you guys, Felix Von Grizz, Baby Cup, Ginger Liz, and about nine badgers. Can you make a chest or storage of any kind? I'm sure you can. I'm positive. Uh, probably something like... There it is, yeah. A basket. <laughs> you can make an angling basket. Let's, let's do it. We'll make a little basket here. How 
How much do you think it can hold? <laughs> uh. Okay, Goose is four minutes left to beat level three. Now, should make another. Another foundation. Ginger Liz, you know what to do. Thanks again, Craft Lab. Again, I don't know. I think I would assume when I get wet, that just means that I'm cold. Uh. Does it not lock into the... Oh, there we go. Okay, so what? Better or worse than Enshrouded? I don't know. I only played an hour. Um, how to play. Wet. Every game should have a moist meter. <laughs> uh, da -da -da -da. Crude solid wall. Need lots of wood bundles for that. I guess I could make a full stone wall here. Two and a half minutes left to beat the level three on the hype train. If we get to the end of level five, I'm going to give away four video games. Uh, one of which is any game at all. Four, uh, three of which are video games that I choose. I'm going to make... Uh, how about this? Do I not have... I thought I had... Do I not have six stone blocks? Oh, I thought I did. Did I take them out of the basket? I didn't. Okay, that's the problem. Let's put this... How about right here? Basket right over here. <laughs> this little glitch into the walls, it looks like. Hipcad's gifting another sub to Nars Arsicist. Or Nars Arsist. Nars Arsicist? Nars, do something nice for somebody else. Uh, let's go make some more stone blocks. Intense toast. You can call me Big Mommy anytime you want. <laughs> anytime you want. Oh, there's lightning? That's not good. Return to Puck? I'm busy, Puck. I'm doing the thing you told me to do. Why didn't it build? How far you've come, and yet how little. 30 seconds left, Gooses. Is it an ascetic purity that keeps oh, the there it goes. That just to took forever. homely presentation? No. It seems more apt that thou merely <laughs> that jackass is in the wall. to all that could be thine. Across these wilds, your kind have proliferated with haste. Industrious and more than willing to avail amidst your ever-growing need. That's enough, Puck. I don't care. All right, excellent try on the hype train. We'll uh, we'll add more games to the next hype train. As always, thanks again. Goose's Craft Lab, Intense Toast, Hip Gads, Chief Chavez, Radosaurus. I just get... why am I getting hurt? I'm getting hailed on? 
<laughs> Is there a roof? Upper floor. Upper floor. Ow! <laughs> Upper floor is kind of a roof. <laughs> this hail has really screwed me up. Right. I can't rest because I probably need a roof. Boy, this hail is... Yeah, I guess I could use my Healy stuff. Nine. There we go. Um. Roof. Place. There we go. It's perfect. <laughs> Uh, all right. Now I can make a, b a bed. I need more plant fibers. Of course I do. That's another thing that uh, survival games... A lot of a lot of them don't do very well. What Power World did really well was that you're always weighed down, always, just constant. And most survival games really need to learn this lesson. Uh, you shouldn't be weighed down all the time. <laughs> like it's just like I just wish that they would get that shit through their head. I did it. I got my short rest. Let's make a campfire here. Uh, I want to say it's this. Right next to the bed. Where where it always should be. Oops. Oh, there we go. I wonder if this goes rotten. Yeah, the one thing that I did that I loved about Power World was it like prioritized fun, you know? It just, it prioritized having fun over, like, limiting you and making you do things over and over. Alright, let's eat some food. Mmm. And I have a berry. Mmm. Alright, back to... Back to uh, getting getting things to create walls. Yeah, craft lab. I know, right? It doesn't make any sense. It's a single player game. <laughs> Unlock simple sewing bench. Purchase a simple sewing bench from the essence trader. So that's what he was trying to talk to me about as I was getting hailed on. So we're going to... I wonder if the essence trader is on the map. Oh yeah, here we go. Perfect. Hey, Captain Fabulous. 
Thank you very much, Captain Fabulous, for using your Prime over here. Uh, I appreciate it very much. I look at these games like they're made for people who always whine about how many hours a game has in it. Yeah, they kind of are. You're right. Uh, that doesn't mean they're fun, though. People whine about how many hours in a, uh, a game has in it because to them it's not fun, so it might be too short. And then these are too long, you know? Um, well, why wouldn't I? Everything should have a window. Uh, if you right click on the map, you can make waypoint. I know, but I don't really need one. I just need to, uh, well, that's too big. I just wanted to make sure it was on the map. Ooh. Secret mushrooms. Oops, I'm using the wrong thing. Enshrouded, I think, was pretty good about uh, not weighing you down too much, too. Yeah, immediately weighed down, boy's soul, like right away. Oh my gosh, Krafa, that's terrible. Let's build... Let's build another foundation, actually. Oh, I had enough. Wow. I think I can do this. I can just put these all up like this. And then make some roofs. Wood bundle. Oh, interesting. It can. This is a, this is kind of a cool feature. So all the stuff that I put out, it combines all the resources together. So I it. Um, then I need like it. It was telling me what I need basically, but for everything. So that's cool. I like that. Uh, so now I need, I need like a bunch of plant fiber, wood bundles, sticks, and stone blocks. That's useful. I don't know if I can pin that stuff, but it's super useful. Useful to know all those things that are there. Wow. What the hell? Oh, is it just a collect? Why do I keep seeing... What does this turn into? I don't know if I'm doing any... Am I doing anything to it? Oh, there we go. Two wood bundles? That wasn't worth it. That wasn't worth it at all. Like, these come down way faster. Does this hurt me? Oh, it does. It Wait, it glitches through trees, but it doesn't hurt, but it hurts me? The fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? It does look like cannabis, yeah. Hold E to collect everything in an area at once. Oh, okay, all right. Will do. Uh. Yeah, progression does feel slow. Yes, absolutely. All right, so hold E. 
Ooh, that is useful. Thank you. Love that. Craft Lab, you know I always appreciate you uh, going out of your way. Oh, I should have extinguished this. This is just wasting. It's still way down, huh? Cool. E to immediately be weighed down. This game is uh, online. I would imagine you... I don't know that you can play this offline by yourself. Probably not, but who knows? Give me those stones. Oh wow, okay. That was a... Turning into me, crap lab. Uh, all right. Um, well, this is sort of nice. I made a nice little hovel. This should be fine, I think. What can I make here? What do I need? Straps. I think I can make straps here. Oh, I have. I guess I'll do that. Yeah. And then I put a bunch of hides in here. Yeah, and Shrouded's great. I've, I've, I mean, they, they can, you know, both be good. All right, so then I need to make, I need a wood bundle. Oh yeah, <laughs> craft. That's that's interesting. An interesting thing that does happen. Let's make this thing first. Okay. And then that should can I move these around? Yeah. Make shift wood axe, simple wood axe. And then I need oh a bow! Uh, I need a mining pick maybe next, so let's do a stone block. Alright, boys, soul. Uh... Hey, what's this? What's this little structure? What's this about? It's a... A scary cemetery. <laughs> Great! 
A really scary cemetery. Can you dig? I don't think that you can dig. I could be wrong, though. I haven't tried. Also, that did that not bring up my... Hold on a minute. Did that not bring up my gear score? That's a 20. Is gear only the capelet? Or is gear this stuff too? Does anyone know? Chat? Any Candace, is it just your clothes? Is it just your clothes and not your weapons? Because it's not allowing me to, let's see here, simple mining pick. This would take the place of that. Drop this over here. Oh, it's going up. Okay, good. It is going up. All right. I was like, what the fuck? I was worried about that. I'm going to make a knife now. Hey, give me that. Yeah, it's going, the gear, gear score is going up, but it's taking a little bit. Okay. Put that here. This goes there. Oh, I didn't mean to eat those mushrooms. <laughs> I did not mean to do that. Hmm. 20, 20. I probably need to make some shirts and stuff. But I do want to make a bow. I don't know what happens. Do you have to make also arrows? Generally you do. Uh, rock marble? What the fuck is rock marble? Realm walkers must craft what few marbles they can from stone itself. Oh, if you light the fire, you'll craft faster. Yeah, I'd, that that makes sense. That was like you'll craft faster if it's built in a uh, shelter as well. Uh, okay. I can't tell if like some of this stuff is like just stronger wood. Like why is it taking me so long to chop through this? There's a structure. There's a structure over here. What is that? Ooh, what is that? Yeah, 
I don't really have to worry about how fast things are getting uh, crafted, which is good. Okay. How does the sling bow work? Empty. How do I make... How do I make arrows? Arrowed. Is it arrows? Oh, the slingbow shoots rocks. Got it. Just need a bunch of uh, these guys. Hey, I'm weighed down. Great. It's one shot. Okay, and there's an and there's an arc to it. How much do these weigh? Does crafting use items in storage? I don't think that it does. I have not seen that doing that. Boy, do I wish it did though. That's another thing that uh, I think both Enshrouded and Pal World did, and I loved. Um, very useful. Very, very useful. Should be mandatory, absolutely. 100%. Your score is still at 13. Oh. Come back here. Wow, it took that like a champ. Oh yeah, sorry crap. Up. Um, just absolutely took it like a champ right in the butt and ran away. Uh, what else do I need to make? Is the tanning thing, does this make clothes? What else makes clothes? Synthetic, it's good. It's a it's a grind, like most survivals are. Way more way more so than I feel like Enshrouded or Pal World was. Um where do I make different clothes, chat? Where is that? Tanning station, campfire, and workbench. I've got all that stuff. Maybe I can't make... Maybe I cannot make different clothes yet? The sewing bench. I have to go talk to that dude. That's right. Ooh, that's that's pretty. Um, well, let's go. Let's venture out into the night and shoot some deer in the butt. Just <laughs> shoving mushrooms in my face. <laughs> More stuff to weigh me down, I know, right? I am totally going the wrong way. Okay. Hey, what's this? Do I have... I don't think I... Do I not have the... Uh, oh, I do. Oh, great. I'm cold. So I've mined that. Hopefully if I have the uh, torch out. There we go. That'll keep me warm.
Is that ore? Yeah. Hey, Great Bones! Thank you, Great Bones. Uh, Great Bones, I am enjoying this. Uh, but I, I would imagine it's probably more fun with friends and it'll pick up a lot faster uh, because it's a grind at the beginning. It's a, it's a grind. Thanks again, Void Rocks and Great Bones for the prime. How much, how are we doing on inventory? It's really fun when you start portal hopping and getting the neat cards. Yeah, that's, I would imagine that's going to take a little bit to get there. Was it? Did, did I shoot you earlier? Was that you? <laughs> What's making this game stand out from other survivors? I don't know, Artrius. I haven't gotten there yet. I've only played it an hour and 40 minutes. I'm partial to saying that it's probably because you can teleport between worlds and pick the world that's right for you and then set up there, but I don't know what it is. I have yet to find the gameplay loop that, because uh, like PAL world immediately, the, ga the gameplay loop was, oh, catching, catching PALs. That's, that's what makes this fun and making them work for you. Uh, in Shrouded, I never really got to the point where I was like, oh, I get this. I think I got close to it. What's that noise? Why is it scary? No! Stay away! Always out of stamina. <laughs> These deer. These fucking deer. Oh, well, hello, hello, nurse. <laughs> ah! Oh shit! I was just trying to get some water. Jeez! Can you guys go away, please? How many? How many more? Can we? Can we all just chill? I want to stare at this statue. I just wanted to stare at the statue, have a drink of water. Ah, the good life. The good life, huh? The good life. Do I hear more roaring? Uh, the old double moons. That's right. Hold on. The old double moons, guys. You know what? Who doesn't need more moons? You know what I'm saying, guys? Who doesn't need more moons? So what if this is a man? Who cares if this is a man on the other side? That'd be amazing. I can admire a beautiful... Uh, backside. Doesn't matter who it's attached to. You know? 
You guys need to normalize admiring bodies. Uh, am I going the right way? I am. Okay. Ass to ass. Ow. Well, that <laughs> Fury, thanks for clipping that. <laughs> that was a pretty solid clip, yeah. Cheeks is cheeks. Yeah, this would be more fun with more people because you just get through these these milestones a lot faster, so. If only I could climb. I'm terrible at climbing, apparently. I think I can mantle. Can't I mantle? I have to Skyrim up this mountain. There we go. Yeah, you can mantle just randomly. It's like lethal company. Come on, mantle it! Super 360 Mario, thank you for using your Prime over here for three months. Kind of a new goose. Appreciate that, Super 360 Mario. Uh-oh. I hear some big boys. Come over here. Man, I'm just getting beat up on. I really wish that my stamina would not get used when I miss. That's super annoying. That's really, really annoying. What's this? This knife is putting in work. Hold on, let me see if uh, I'll repair it. There we go. There's got to be an entryway or something. Oh, here we go. Hello, Wilhelmina Sassy. I'm a refugee. I'm not in the habit of divulging such information to a stranger. You're speaking with a realm walker extraordinaire. I am a talented, well-traveled realm walker. That's correct. Columnist for the Nightingale's Finest Paper. Sunday Courier. All right. Uh, you mentioned protection. My esteemed colleague here is always looking for work, and I'm sure they're about somewhere. They're a quiet sort, but I'm sure you'll find them to be a capable combatant, builder, roused about, whatever you might require. Once their work is finished, that seems quite reasonable. Why should I be concerned with their... Um, all right, done and done. Realm walkers can find other survivors to help them in their search for Nightingale. My completed task. Oh, this is amazing. Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. Thank the Lord in heaven if this is what I think it is. Uh, you may enable the use of storage containers for survivors by changing the permissions in each container. They're pals. Exactly. I'm getting a Kelvin, Fury. That's correct. Uh... Tell me those rumors. I want to hear a rumor. I simply cannot ply my trade for free. Have you heard tell of anyone notable out in the realms? Uh, Aurelio, Acevedo, Ortega. In my journeys, and never have I seen someone so clearly plagued by the gold sickness. Never mind. That's all for now. Okay. So I guess I could make a bed there if I need to. Complete the encounter and recruit a survivor. Hmm. A simple sewing bench. 
I need 55 essence dust. Um, let's see here. I don't want to extract. Candace, how do I split things? How do I split stacks? Is there a way? What's up, report turret? It's not right click. Not shift. It's not shift click. Oh, wait, no, that's drop or extract. Shift right. It's not shift right click. Hmm. I really wish I knew what it was. Maybe control click? No. Not control right click. Hey, who's that? Who's that? Oh, well, let's begin. Manual, what do you, what do you need me to do? Yeah, I want to split the stack in my inventory, though, because I, I need to extract some of them for uh, essence dust, but not all of them. Does he follow me? What's happening? Whoa, what the fuck? I didn't realize I could even do that. Or just right click is a crazy jump. What do I do with this dude? <laughs> Says you can't split an inventory. Yeah, that's that's super weird. Oh, right click extract. Yeah, that's true. You can select an amount. Okay. That's sort of like splitting. Uh that's a kind of like splitting, sort of. Um Well, I'm going to go pick up rocks, I guess. Each weapon has a different right click. Oh yeah, you're right, it does. Look at that, I didn't know that. What is that? I wonder what the right click is for this thing. It's just that, okay. Um. Blocks with the axe is super handy. Uh, like that? Okay, yeah. Simple sewing bench. Five. Okay, what does manual do? How can I tell him what to do? Where do, where do I look at my... In the guidebook? What's up, Stewie and Sangroku? What does my, what does my buddy do? Oh, you need to do his quest, which is build the shit they have there. Oh, interesting. 
Is there a way to look at my quests, Candace? Can I see what I'm looking like? Like, rather than just, it just says complete an encounter and recruit a survivor, but I don't know what to do. What does that mean exactly? You know what I'm saying? J. Uh, okay, there we go. There we go. Um, found the complete the construction of their three bed rolls in a campfire to recruit them. Thank you very much, uh, Candace. That helps tremendously. Frank Morning Tree. Thank you, Frank Morning Tree, for being here almost a year and a half. Always good to see Frank around here. I don't think I even need this shit. I need rocks, sticks, and plant fiber. Oh, scary. Man, you gonna help me over here? Manual? Manual! Hello? Manual! Hey, brother! There we go, get him! Nice job, Manuel. You missed a thousand times, but great job. Way to go. <laughs> Manuel's not the greatest. I guess maybe I can give him a, a better weapon or something. Oh, I don't need that shit. I need I just need normal stones. Are those ghost wolves? What are those? They're just normal wolves. Jumping in front of my shot. Jeez. <laughs> Where is Manuel? <laughs> Manuel's just <laughs> just giving up on helping me. Come on, dude. Do I have enough? Okay. Yeah, no, I, I was just... Uh, you're, you're totally right, Candace. I was just kidding around. Manuel's just not... He's worthless. He's worthless until I finish his task. There you go, Manuel. Ooh. Goodbye, magic chest. Oh, actually, no. Alright, now what? Recruit! Manage equipment and inventory. Great job, buddy. So he's got all this stuff. Looks like he can carry stuff for me. He does have a pretty cool mustache, you're right. You can pay him in shirt buttons. He loves shirt buttons. Steal his hat? Should I steal his hat? It's actually a pretty good hat, you're right. Let me go ahead and take his shirt. And his hat. <laughs> This should bring my gear score up, I think. It did. Okay, there we go. Phil! <laughs> Take off your pants. Uh, give me your pants. Thank you, Phil, for the uh, three months in advance. Phil75. 
Phil will see you here for the next three months. That's huge. That's huge, Phil. That's huge, Phil. That's huge. Uh, let's see if I can... What else can I take from him? The gloves. He, his Everything's better. His little backpack is better. Oh, wow. His boots are better. <laughs> uh, let's see here. I'm going to give him all this garbage for sure. Does this bring up my gear score? I guess my gear score is only as high as it'll... I don't really... I, it's really hard to tell that gear score. I don't... It looks like it's an average, but... Uh... Right there. We're at 18 out of 20. Oh yeah, he has, I'm, I forgot to put on his duster. Where does this go, even? Where does his duster go? Man, man, you look... Gr Honestly. This is manual. <laughs> this is my first NPC, yeah. <laughs> manual is taking this like a champ. Transfer, transfer. Here, you, here, manual, you can have all this stuff. You can have all my old shit. Here, take this. Um, oh, whoops. Did I steal it all back? I did. I took it all back because I was like, I was like, you know what? You can have this. And I was like, never mind. This is mine. <laughs> How do I make him equip it? Over here? The tooltip pops up over it, so it's kind of... That's sort of wonky. Ever, st <laughs> Ever stalwart manual. Is this solely a PvE game? I think so. I think that it is. How do I, how do I, does he only, can I make him do tasks or does he just run around with me? Can I like tell him to do other things? How do I make him do tasks? I wonder what they, do they have anything that I can buy? Ooh, a simple mall. Uh, ooh, a fishing rod. Saw table, smelter. Can I sleep in these beds, maybe? Oh, I can. Oh, interesting. Okay, creatures, yeah. An umbrella is a glider? That's cool. Hold on, let me let me eat my breakfast of mushrooms. There we go. Mmm, yummy. Okay. How much essence do I have? I need a bunch more essence. How do I get him to do things? So I have I have this dude, but he doesn't do anything. Does he break rocks or what?
Depending on the tool you have equipped on him, he'll do the thing if you're in an area with that resource. Shit, I wish I could go back to... Oh, there he goes. Great job, bud. Boy, that was impossibly slow, but... You're doing great. Uh... He really is as useless as Kelvin in Sons of the Forest. Wow, those stones are really worth a lot of essence. Kelvin got a huge upgrade? Finally, because Kelvin was worthless when, you first, when the game first came out. Uh, simple Mall. Pounding stakes makes a devastating melee weapon with massive heft and slow sling. Well, I wonder if the mall will bring up my gear score. Let's see what happens. Or do I have to make it? Do I have to make that thing? Or is that so that's just a... Uh, Hey, my capacity's at 90. I wonder why. Maybe because I ate a bunch? <laughs> now you look like an extra from Peaky Blinders. Oh yeah, maybe it's yeah, maybe it's the backpack. Simple mall. There it is. Uh, Candace, how do I get my gear score up from 18 to 20? <laughs> What's the fastest way to do this? Because I could buy different recipes over here, but I need to know they don't. It doesn't tell you what the gear score is, so I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be buying. Uh, saw table, saw table, and smelter. Just go build out of your base. Okay. All right, Manuel. You, you and me, baby. Let's head back. At least there's a fast travel. Did Manuel come with me? There he is. What happened to your health, bud? Are you hung? Do I have to feed Manuel? Do I have to feed him, chat? Um, let's see here. Workbench, sewing bench. There we go. Do I really, do I have to feed the dude? That's super annoying if I do. This, does this only give me one? Two bundles of wood. Uh. Okay. The simple boots, but I have all this stuff. This isn't going to bring my gear score up. None of this stuff... I think all the stuff that I'm wearing is better than what I have. This is modern. Newsboy. So I don't think this is going to help me. Uh, Colby Graham! Thank you, Colby, for the raid. Thank you very much, Colby. Very, very much. Uh, Ultra Woodio, it's a, it's a grind at the beginning. That's for sure. Yeah, I don't really know that this is these are going to help me here. Thanks, Colby. Hmm. That's not going to help me. 
Does it show item level in the simple stuff? I would... Wouldn't you assume that a simple capelet is worse than what I have? But I'll go get some plant fiber and we'll, we'll confirm. Manuel, go do stuff. You're just following me around. That's all you're doing. Super annoying, Manuel. Plus you're hurt. Uh, let's make a simple shirt. I don't... I would be blown away. Oh, it is better than... Wow. Okay. Look at that. A simple is better than a modern. <laughs> I would never have guessed. What else do I need? Okay. These boosts should be better, right? Yeah. Oh my gosh, are you fucking kidding me? Manuel, where'd you go? Manuel! How many uh, NPCs can you recruit? Now, Maria, it's always in the category, Maria. <laughs> Thanks, Maria, for the four years of Tier 2. Thank you very much, as always, for being Maria, Maria. I saw a Nerp in here earlier as well. Love it. Love it. Manuel, get out of my face. He's scaring the shit out of me. Uh, what else do I need more of? I need more leather. Do I have leather in here? Nerf's always lurking. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? I think only one can follow you at a time, but if they, I don't know if they stick around your base. I'm not that far in yet. Okay. They see Raven. They seem it. They certainly seem it. Manuel, go do something. Go get some rocks or something, man. Go kick rocks. I'm busy. Can't you see I'm busy crafting? Okay, so now we can make some gloves. Will this bring up my gear score, please? Oh my gosh, are you fucking kidding me? What's the problem? What do I need to, whoa, what the hell am I wearing? <laughs> uh, this. I think I have to go kill some stuff to get more leather. What can I make that, because it looks like I need to bring up all of my gear score. So I'm at 19 out of 20. And I've been at 19 out of 20 for the last three things I crafted. So that sucks. I just need to go kill. What the hell was that? One of these dudes. Hey.
headshot. Okay, I missed. Get a manual. Nice. Way to go. Headshot. Manual. Manual. Come on, manual. Manual. <laughs> Am I getting hide from these dudes? Oh yeah, I am okay. Manual's carrying me. Manual, I feel like Manual's not doing anything. What are you doing? Bruce screaming at Manuel like the girl with the emo. <laughs> he did not do... He didn't do nothing. He didn't do shit. Uh, we gotta make some leather. It should craft faster with the fire lit, right? Yeah, it's a little faster. Candace. Oh, thanks, Candace. Yeah, it's taking a little bit, I guess. I want to know. I wish I could see what this mall would do. Like, in terms of damage. Before I craft it. Kind of weird that I can't see that. Wait, what? Did I not pick up the leather? Thank you, Duke. For that that prime, Duke. Uh, I want to say Duke Bear is the beginning of a hype train here. It is. Uh, Duke Bear, do something nice for some. Or I'm sorry. Uh, if you uh, if the gooses start a hype train, my brain just broke for a second. If the gooses start a hype train. I'm going to give away five video games. If we uh, get get a hype train to the end of level five. I'm going to give away five video games. And four more people to start the train. If you fill out the spots, it might show what it will, what it will end up as. Oh. My brain just literally broke. I'm going to need lots more leather here. Alright, what do I need? Gear. I need a hat, too. up Dom four more people to start it uh, all right we'll let that go we'll pick up some plant fiber here Manuel you should be out here doing this you know you should be out here doing all this Manuel and you're not I should be able to tell you Go pick up stuff. 
And uh, that would be rad if the game allowed me to do that. A simple head wrap. Hey, I did it. Okay. Antiquarian Major card. Here, I have this for you. Oh, if you give him a sickle. Actually, I might be able to give him a sickle from this stuff over here. Because I think I, yeah, I put my old shit in here. Uh... Here, Manuel. I'm going to give you some, some new stuff. Let's see what you do with it. How about this? Transfer. Transfer. What are you going to go do now? I gave him the, I gave him new new tools, but uh, I don't know. You have him equipped the sickle. I think that'll be his primary gathering. I gave him a hunting knife, a wood axe, and a mining pick. How about that? Unlock antiquarian card. Which contains all I need to craft it more powerful. In order to access it, I'll need to nurture my hope. The key to passing through the site's gate. Unlock through completion of the antiquarian site of power. Where would the antiquarian site of power be? There it is. Oh, <laughs> Micah. Eat. Do a little short rest there. And then off we go. What the fuck are those? What the hell are those? What are those things? Manuel weeps internally with the joy with joy at the gifts he's received. Got to hand it to the uh the video game here. I didn't get disconnected for for steam um maintenance, which just happened a few minutes ago, so I appreciate that. Got to hand it to him. Manually still with me? Oh boy, he is. He's trying to figure it out. Look at him go. He's like a mountain goat. Yeah, Donktar, and I, that's why I didn't stream Helldivers. This is one of the many reasons I didn't stream Helldivers today. Because. Uh, not only did I fight the queue for an hour and not get in, but uh, I knew that it would disconnect me at 3 o'clock in the middle of the stream. And then I would have trouble getting back on because of, <gasps> you guessed it, the queue. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to play the Sons of the Forest new update. That's a good question, actually. JP was asking me about it, and I'm... So, maybe? Let's see. Oh, what? You're already up here. Maybe you could help me out, dude. 
You ever think about that? Manual should sit in a hell diver's queue. Get him, man. Oh, Manual, kill the other one, dude. <laughs> I like when they bark as they die. Oh, look at him. He's chopping down trees. That almost killed me. <laughs> I love that you hold your snacks while you're fighting. Alright, we're headed to the Conquer this site to receive the means to open antiquarian realms. Conquer? How do I conquer this site? How do you suppose I conquer the antiquarian site of power? With my army, I know, with, with manual. Also, wait, I just realized I have a rewards. No, I just have I have like a little mail icon on my screen. I don't even know how to, how to check my mail. Well, it looks like I can get it to the top up there. OK. Hey, Edu Chico. Thank you for the prime, Edu Chico. The gooses are about to start a hype train. Four more people to start it. If we get to the end of level five, I give away five video games. Five of them. Cool. Manuel, can you come in here with me? Terrific. All right. Where's he going? Manuel! Where did he go? Manuel! Manuel! What's happening? <laughs> uh, Laura Key, gifting to Simfire. Simfire, do something nice for somebody else. Oh, JP. Uh, it, uh, it'll definitely be more fun with uh, with you or anybody. Like more people, honestly. Man, he almost fucking killed me. I didn't get anything from him? Well, that's bullshit. Manual, what the fuck were you doing, dude? Manual was literally doing nothing. He was just chilling. Slight restful potion, slight healing potion. Oh, okay, all right. I can I can actually use the salve. There we go. A uh, new card. Lustrate infusion poison resist. How could you tell that I got a new card? Um at the top. It just says unlock antiquarian card though. Uh, three more people to start the uh, hype train if y'all want me to give away video games. 
Oh, there you are. How convenient. How convenient. Weighted card, weighted eminent. Play this card to increase the damage you, de you deal and the efficiency of your harvesting. How do I play the card? Huh. Yeah, how do I play that card, I wonder? <laughs> it's just teleporting. Need to go to the realm transmuter. Oh, it's a location. All right, yeah, I'm, I'm done with that. Secrets? No secrets? Oh. Manual. Okay, manual. <laughs> Red rum. Man, you look out. That one's got grenades. Okay, you, you know what to do. Go over there. Manual. Can they jump over? Where is where did he go? <laughs> what the fuck? You showed up at the perfect time. The perfect time, Manuel, after I killed all of them. Spiders. You son of a bitch. He is so broken. So broken. He always shows up after I have completed all the combat. Manual, manual will always be with you spiritually, not just physically. Or just not physically is what, what I meant to say and what, I, what you wrote, which is much funnier. Let's see if Manuel's behind me. Yeah, sort of. Still not really sure. All right, here we go. This is some sort of boss, maybe? What the fuck? Manuel! Go get him, buddy. Finally! There we go. Look at that, he knocked him back to the Stone Age. Goodness gracious. I gotta eat a burrito, hold on. <laughs> there we go. Good job. You finally did something. Get in there, bud. Gotta get a little Chipotle burrito going. 
Play this card to increase the damage, increase your swimming speed. Are these permanent buffs or are those temporary buffs? Those cards that I'm picking up. Because if they're permanent buffs, that's pretty awesome. But I think they, they seem like they might be temporary. They're permanent on the realm you play them on, but you can change them by playing another one. Interesting. Huh. Manual, please. Oh, big boy there. I'm out of stamina. Oh. Ow. Whoa. I'm wet. I'm so tired of you. I gotta repair my knife really quick. Hold on. Okay, we did it. We did it, you and I. We're the greatest. Stabilize! Thank you, Stabilize. Good to see you stable. Good to see you stable. Four more people to start the hype train. If we get to the end of a level five hype train, I'm going to give away five video games. One of which is any video game at all. Four of which are video games of my choice. Uh, this charm. Well, that's probably for uh, for the benches. Thanks again, Stable. Always. Did Manuel just teleport down there? Yeah, he did. Get a manual. Look out, buddy. Make it pay. That's doing no damage. Oh. Am I on fire? Is that what's going on? Oh my gosh, I got fucking stacked up against the fucking pillar. Get a manual. Hammer on him, dude. Oh, man.
Way to go, bud. That was real good. You did it. You did a real good job there. Oh, well done, Ralph. You did a real Walker. good job. Well done. Your deed befits the title, and the wider realms are within your reach. Puck like that. <laughs> ah. But you feel I've foxed you. Betraying no foresight of the dangers held within these walls. Listen, for I come with broom before to sweep this dust behind the door. Though I did smirk, watching from the shadows, All right, I was Puck. heartened to a spy All that right. my gifts are not wasted on thee. Our partnership blooms with the seal of a most fruitful requital. Assurances in hand. Press onward. Mark inky images upon paper, and so direct the flow I'm so of tired the interrelmic void. So tired of him. Might I suggest, for your first foray, a forest augmented by your new antiquarian knowledge. There are others like you, lost Take refugees, his clothes. strangers to these fey wilds. So too are there more seasoned realm walkers who might point you toward Nightingale better than I. Go then with newly fashioned cards. Awaken yonder portal and tread on toward that which is boundless beyond the measurable. Okay. Craft both a forest card and antiquarian card and traverse a fey portal. Unlock simple saw table, smelter, and mortar station. Um, I guess maybe the fastest way out is this fast travel. Um, hmm. Hey, where's my other? Get in here. Man, you'll take a damage. Uh Okay. Saw table, which I don't think I can make yet. I have to go I think I have to go run back and purchase those things. I believe I have to purchase those uh blueprints. And then how do I craft a forest card and antiquarian card? How do I craft cards? With what? With what? Candace. Water doesn't hurt you. Uh, the hail hurts you. And it was hailing for a second. Not anymore. Use the new tables? Okay. What was that? Manuel, what are you doing? Manuel, go chop shit down. What are you doing, bud? Uh, mining pick. Yeah, you have a wood axe. What? And then once I craft those cards, I... I portal to somewhere else. Is that what's going on? Is that what's happening? Yeah. Thank you, Candace. Extract that. So far, stones seem the best way to... Running around and collecting stones seems the best way to make the most essence the fastest. To a forest antiquarian realm specifically. I'll take a short rest here. Eat a burrito. I guess I could collect plant fibers too. I don't know if plant fibers also gives me. Yeah, plant fibers is pretty quick too. I need a hundred and was that hundred and sixty-five ish?
Uh, the game is... It is well made, but it also feels very much like a grind. So... If, I think... Again, I think this is more on the level of Enshrouded. Uh, Pal World, not at all. Like, Pal World is like a really casual... Nicely done... And this is going to be a, a grindy thing. Where eventually I think people are going to be... Uh, like, doing cool stuff and finding cool places and stuff, but I don't... I don't... I'm not quite at the spot where I think I want to invest... I don't know. 160 hours, you know? Ooh, Case! Thank you, Case! Thank you very much, Case. You can have up to six people, and that's what you want to do. Like, you want to play this game with six people. Uh, thank you very, very much, Case, for the raid. Welcome in, everybody. I'm playing Nightingale. Brand new survival game came out today. Um, and we were just talking about it compared to Enshrouded. Enshrouded, I feel, may maybe feels a little more fun. Because it seems like the hook for this game is that you travel to different worlds. Kind of like a Starfield or a No Man's Sky. But it's taking a long time to get to the even the part where I can teleport to another world. Uh, that's taking me like three hours just to get to those those spots. Thank you, Case. I hope you have a great day, Case. But like I said, six, having six people would would make this go a lot quicker. Having like to collect a bunch of all the all the resources and shit like that. So I also don't know if it scales if it scales enemies for uh, how many people you have. Um, if you're coming in from Case's stream, uh, if we beat a level five hype train, I'm gonna give away five video games, uh, four of which. Are video games that I choose and one of which is a video game that the winner chooses you have to complete tasks or quests within a certain time not that I've seen no I don't think it is I don't think it's time gated At least the currency is quick. I appreciate that. Oh yeah, I need the umbrella. That's right. I forgot about the umbrella. Do you choose games based on their console or PC? No, never. I have a PC. I've been a PC gamer for 25 years. I love games on PC, but uh, I'll play whatever. Doesn't matter to me. Like, I'll be playing uh, Final Fantasy Rebirth when that comes out. And that's only on PlayStation. Saw Table Smelter and I. I. And was it Mortar Station? Yes. Oh, Aunt Candace, it's all good. I appreciate you helping me. Uh, yeah, five people drop 100 bits. The hype train begins, and then if we get to the uh, end of level five of that train, I give away five video games. Um, where was... Where was the umbrella? Cool. All right. Now we travel back to our little base. We need to make Enchanter's Focus. What is the Enchanter's focus? Lumber, ingot, and glass. Simple mortar station. That, that requires lumber. Okay, this looks like... 
I think I can make a saw table. Saw table is my, probably next on my list here. Yeah, I really wish it would take from your storage, but it doesn't. Okay. Oh, thanks, buddy. He put his wood, his stone blocks in there. That was really nice of you. Yeah, there's no loading time. That's a really interesting. There's there's no loading time on fast traveling from uh, from anywhere it seems, which I thought was really super cool. Jeremy, probably yeah. Animal fiber. Does this make? Can you chop the stumps? You can, but it takes a really long time for some reason. I don't know why. Yeah, Joluku, I plan on it. How likely am I retur to return to this game? The The question is, is never about me returning to the game. All right, this requires... So this is... I, I can make lumber here. Uh, and then... It's about whether or not you guys like watching it and supporting it. Smelter. That requires stone block and rocks. Go chop shit down. What's up, Jabate? I need stone block and rock, so I wonder if I can get manual to go if I can do this. He should be able to You know, Jeremy, that is not the case. Um, I appreciate you saying that, and I appreciate you believing that, but that is absolutely not the case. Uh in a in a uh, a larger sense. Um, I need lots of stones and rocks. I also love that the wolves, where are the wolves? I love that the, uh, you can hold E and it'll collect everything. I'm a big fan of that. Where are those wolves? Super Mando, I this is, I think if you like Enshrouded, I think you'll like this like this game. I I really do. I'm a I, I'm confident that this is like a, a Enshrouded style. That you would uh, you'd be into. Has the big boy Carnute spirit scared you? No. no. Where are those wolves? I hear him. I hear him roaring. Always weighed down by my inventory. That's true, Candace. I can, but I'm, at this point, I'm just going to use it to craft anyway. So, I'm just about there. Okay. Let's go ahead and get rid of this and that. No, Super Mando, I appreciate you asking. Uh, what can I make here? What does the smelter make? Am I not looking at the right spot? Ah, glass and ingots, okay. I 
And then the mortar station. I need three lumber and eight fiber. I don't know what gives me fiber. Read this. What gives me fiber? Candace! Oh, Candace! Thank you, Candace, for almost, uh, for over four years now. We're all going on five. Um, four more people to start the hype train that Candace may have started. Yeah, it, it's cozy, exactly. What gives me fiber? That's next to my list. The mortar station. Okay, buddy. Go out and start chopping wood. Candace, what gives me regular fiber? Go chop wood, dude. Go. Go chop wood. Uh, cryptid, I had planned on it, yeah. I had planned on playing Pacific Drive. I enjoyed playing it when I did. Let's go make some lumber. I think it's just saying you can use any fiber, so plant fiber might work. Oh, interesting. Okay. Uh, Oh yeah, I think you're right. Look at that. Uh Hesmuset? Boy. I wish I wish I knew how to say that. Hesmuset. Thank you, Hesmuset, for being a new goose. Uh three more people to start the hype train. Three more people to start the hype train. Has me set? I said it right? Oh my gosh, I did it. Thank God. Blue Metallic Crow, thank you for the bits, Blue Metallic Crow. Two more people to start the hype train. This is a simple mortar station. This makes me flower. Okay. Let's see here. What else we got? Uh... Enchanter's Focus. I need five glass. I think this made glass. It does. Oh. There she goes. Okay. Craft both a forest card and an antiquarian card and traverse a fey portal. Got it. Goose is two more people. Drop 100 bits. The hype train goes. And then if somebody blows it away or the gooses combine, uh, I'm going to give away five video games. All right. Realm, Walker, Realm Walkers use enchanting tables to, blind, to bind magic to their equipment by crafting enchantments, infusions, and charms. Enchantments, enchantments and fusion and charms can be affixed to equipment. Got it. Lancet, thank you for the bits, Lancet. One more person to start the train. 
Charms are items that can be blah, blah, blah. Enchantments are the most potent of the three. Nice. And then I can use this to craft cards as well. Antiquarian card. Paper, ink, and essence dust. Oh, Candace, thank you for the bits, Candace. One more person. <laughs> Gooses are edging the hype train. <laughs> Thanks, Candace. One more person to start the train. Uh, does the ink... I need paper. What what makes paper? Does this sell? Uh, okay, yeah, this does. And then ink is this thing, and this requires glass and refined pigment. What does this take? Blueberries. is glass okay I think I'm out of glass I think I need more more quartz no it's unique Lancet it's five different people so it's not you Lancet since you already contributed it's five different people so one more person who's not uh, has Muset, blue metallic crow Lancet or Candace that's the way it works I would assume this is... Is this quartz? Yeah, it is. Like, bad idea, for example. 666 bits. Thank you, bad idea. As always. All right, the hype train has begun. The hype train has begun. We're in level one. Yeah, quartz seems to be the easiest one to find. So. Elder Triton gifted to Rollin. Rollin do something nice for somebody else. Dan Servo is waiting, lurking. Dan Servo gifting five people. Katzpa, Creepy Bearded Poodle, Yeezy, uh Kitchen Weirdo, and Darkasil. Uh, pardon, manual. Pardon me. Uh, Stauntaun pushing us into level two. Stauntaun pushing us into level two. Oh, you like what I did, Crankor? And like what I, I added that uh, the goose back in with a little change so that it wouldn't get banned or whatever. We're in level two. If we get to the end of level five, I give away five video games. Five of them. Just need one glass for that. There we go. Antiquarian card. Okay, so I now have an antiquarian card. Where did that go? There it is. Play this card to seek a realm of middling danger. And now I have to craft a forest card as well. Three minutes left on level two. Uh, did I not craft both? And then traverse a fey portal. All right, so now we're headed to the portal. Dirty dirt. Joel gifted to Murderface McMillan. Murderface, do something nice for somebody else. 
Thank you, Dirty Derps, as always. Let's go ahead and take a little rest here. Uh, yes, X Shrike, that is correct. Boy, that was a, actually a very long rest. I'm gonna eat a uh, breakfast burrito. There we go. Have a little breakfast burrito. Mmm, mmm, mmm. And then we're gonna head out to the portal. Let's go. Like I can open it, but I don't. Can I open it? No. What about if I hit it with the? Can I open this coffin? <laughs> no, I can't. Spinstered. Thanks, Spinstered, for the bits very much. I was just trying, you know, just give it a shot. Might as well give it a shot. See if I can bust open that that corpse. Hey, there's a ship over there. Candace, why not? I kind of want to go over to that ship. One minute left to beat the uh, level two on the hype train. Well, oh, this looks like the portal, actually. Yeah, this is the portal. I want to see that. I want to see the giant ship first. Big Bud. Big Bud coming up on four years. Thanks, Big Bud. Always. Who's there? Ah! Make it pay, Manual. Make it pay, manual. There you go, buddy. Looks like there's something up here. A puzzle core? What do I do with this? What do I do with the puzzle core? I got an angler card, but I don't know what that does. Hey, nice try on the on the hype train gooses. Duelist forest weighted car. I don't who knows. That was weird. I'm losing I'm losing frames. I'm trying to sit on it and I can't. Um hmm. Okay, well I don't know what it is. Also I you said I picked up an angler card, but I have no idea where it went, so. Nice job, manual. Where was that ship? Is it my card tab? Amphibious, antiquarian, duelist, forest, weighted, weighted eminent. I don't see angler card anywhere. Do you mean, is it amphibious? Oh, cool. Where is that ship? What happened to that fucking ship? <laughs> I swear I saw that thing on the horizon. portal. There it is. Man, oh man, I was like going crazy. The 
but looks like it should be in this little copse of trees. There it is. Okay. I was like, what? Get over here, Manuel. I'm gonna need your help. That's right, people. I see spiders. Oh. What? I can't climb up this? What the fuck? They're, they're literal stairs. <laughs> That's right, I never put down my chicken wrap. I love my chicken wrap. The chicken wrap, it's actually not a chicken wrap, it's a steak wrap. What's in there? Go up there. <laughs> it's like a little kid running around with like a Capri Sun. <laughs> there we go. This is just, I guess it's just cool. Oh, here we go. Finally. All right. Settler eminent card, carved wood. Oh, and revolver cartridges. But eventually, I'm going to get to a spot that will have bullets. Who knows where Manuel went? Alright, um... Run back to the portal. <laughs> it's all wrapped up and good to go. Like the Taco Bell Crunch Wrap. <laughs> All right, forest card, an antiquarian card. Play this card to seek a realm of middling danger settled by druids and rife with fey ruins. Here we go. So you make different cards to portal to different realms. And I would assume get different... Uh, hey, nice job, Manuel. I would assume to, uh, get different resources. Oh. Manuel! Manuel! Hey. Manuel? go through it yet. <laughs> Maybe he'll just ch chopping down trees. Look out, Manuel. Let's go. How's the AI in this? It's a little wonk. Uh, Bubbles loves Conky. Thank you very much for the Prime Bubbles. It's a little wonky. Could be better. The manual, like the companion AI is a little broken. It's very much like Sons of the Forest when that came out. Having that Kelvin dude around, like he didn't, he didn't, do, he did nothing. Alright, here we go. Oh yeah. Hold a minute, I recognize that dangling chain from miles away. A Realm Walker's pocket watch. 
I carry their hermetic guidebook too. Um, look at him chop. Look at him chop down <laughs> trees. Yeah, the AI's a little. Bro <laughs> the AI's a little broken. He doesn't know which trees to chop down. I mean, he's doing a great job, but. Look at him go. <laughs> the forest is his enemy. <laughs> is there a way back to Earth? Your path, uh, you're fortunate the city still breathes at all. However, the portal network dismantled your path to the city of magic is labyrinth of connections with no map. I cannot get you there, but I have a colleague whose mission matches your own. How do I reach Nelly, the colleague? Uh... All right. I suppose I could give it a try. The Fae hide valuable essences in their architecture. Uh, my head is spinning right here. Acquire tier one essence. It says I already have 20. Oh, okay. It's the green, green essence. Got it. Look at him stalk around chopping down trees and shit. Look at him go. That's right, Jazz, and I love this shirt too. Wow. Oh, he's. I think he's picking up the wood too. Um, manual, manual, do you, do, manual, do you see this, uh, manual, do you see, manual? And you'll just see this giant... I think it's busting down trees as it walks by. Yeah, it is. Look, it's literally chopping down trees. Now that's maybe the first... <laughs> Nothing phases manual. Oh! What happened? What? He's a forest spirit. He doesn't like the tree chopping. Manual, keep chopping down that tree. Keep doing it. Keep doing it. You're doing a great job. Wait a minute, hold on. If he doesn't like manual chopping down trees, how come he's just knocking down trees as he walks by? He thought he left the oven on and then remembered he doesn't have an oven. He's the one knocking down all sorts of trees. Nice job, Manual. All right, well, that was the coolest thing that I've seen so far in this game. I'm going to stop right here. <laughs>